What's up? They told me not to do it. Said I can't do it. Said it wouldn't be exciting, but I'm gonna do it anyway. This is the day in the life of a finish line employee. Let's get it. Dress on the internet, wiki's on the net, blogs in the heavens and get a lot of flack from the internet. Always was that kid with the dead rock. Take a minion from my neighbor, look to your right. Sunset and shade, it never left me. Night up with dust, please. Busy investing all of these questions into confession. Brutus harassing neighbors, you know. No Mr. Feeney gets on of this post. Talking in circles to flow. Piercing with gates with the stone. Some people, some. All right. So right now I'm in the stock room. Stock room is probably one of the most important parts of a finish line store. This is where everything goes down. This is where we come back and find the shoes uh, and bring them out to the floor, bring them out to you guys, the customers. Here's the uh, little uh, back desk or back office. It looks different in every other store, uh, but this is what ours looks like. Pretty exciting. Uh, most of them have a break room, bathroom, mini fridge, microwave, stuff like that, kind of where you just hang out before you clock in or after uh, you are done with your shift, you come back here. This is uh, the last place you'll be before you leave. Then you just kind of walk out. I'll be in and out of the stock room throughout this video and the experience coming back and grabbing shoes. So let's go help some customers. Ooh, nothing left for you. Wonder what to do. Feeling like a tool. Not the fuck discussion. Out of field you bucking. All right, so I don't really know if I can get fired for this video or not, because I don't really know if I should be shooting back here or not. So I'm just going to decide not to shoot on the floor. Um, but. Got a shoe, so I need a nine and a half in the shoe. So what we do is we come back here, check out the style number and the color code, and uh, we try and find the shoe for them. So like, that's what I'm doing right now. Sometimes, you know what I'm saying, it's quick, and other times you actually gotta look, you gotta search. And right now, that's what I'm doing. All right, and here it is. We got the nine and a half right here. All right, two more customers. Uh, it's picking up, it's picking up. It's nice, it's breezy. Uh, it's not too hard. It's like a light little work day. Super light work day. I'm gonna grab these shoes real quick. There's like ladders back here, but I don't really use no ladders. Y'all gonna have to, y'all gonna have to really miss me with these angles for this, for this video tonight. Cause I'm out here. Keep that by the door. Uh, grab this next shoe. Ah, so glad we ran into this problem. So we don't have her size. But it's policy. It's company policy. You can't go out there empty-handed. So you got to either bring something similar or bring a smaller or bigger size. So that was uh, one customer right there. Nice customer. Men's shoe. Those are women's shoes. What did I say? Last video literally just said, or last clip literally just said check the style and the color code and that is the one thing i did not do but it's all right it's all right you learn from your mistakes <sighs> here we go what size is it 10 i think either 10 or 11 we're gonna find out we're gonna find out all right down the ladder we take these customer shoes Thank you, have much love. How you do this? I'm in the middle of top where the root is. And we shot no flat like Vegeta. And read that old school press, felt defeated. And why am I still a kid? Now I mind you. Had a girl spur, miracle besides what I buy. Recognized the been lied just to find two. I truly did not think this would happen this soon. Grab the wrong size. That happens sometimes. You forget. Woo, almost dropped that, but your boy got hands. Forgot. Grab the wrong size. Luckily, we have it. Let me take care of her shoe now. The right size. We make mistakes. We make mistakes. <laughs> That's terrible. Wait, 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 wait. Like this? Oh. Uh, uh. Wait. Oh, oh no, nah, that's a kid. That's on there. Busted. Busted. Why can I bug it? I want it. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey. Hey, we be having fun. <laughs> hey. 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 <laughs> Day's moving right now. Uh, we're kind of busy, uh, but we slowed down a little bit. We're about to close. That's Shelby right here. Shelby, say what's up. Shelby, say what's up. Yeah, Shelby and I have some fun while we're here at work. I'm going to show y'all. Actually, I'm going to insert this little quick video. Check out this video. To die on Finish Line <laughs> versus the world, we take a deep dive, dive through the depths of the stock room. Come with me. Boy. 
Look at this! A rare indigenous species! It's a new balance! Looking like a puma! Stay away! <laughs> boy! Boy! Look at this beauty! It's been here for weeks! <laughs> boy! It's so beautiful! It doesn't know! Like I said... <laughs> like I said... We have fun! <laughs> that was our day! Uh, we actually got pretty busy, so I couldn't record as much as I wanted to. Plus, I'm also not really sure if I could... Re well, I know for sure I can't record while I'm on the floor. But I don't know just how much I can and cannot record while back here. I tried my best to do what I could. Uh, worked with it. Got some shots of the floor when I first came in. Obviously, not while I was on the clock. I uh, did my best to respect the management. Asked them if I could do this. They said okay. So, I, I mean, you know what I mean? That's... Uh, that's what it's kind of like at finish line. It's exciting. That was as a sales associate sometimes. You know, I come in and I help out with stock. Uh, but for the most part, that was just it. So, yeah, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Your boy out. To network while you're at work. Uh, sell your mixtape. Tell people to listen to your radio show.